In this video, we will show you how to set up a blog page for your website step-by-step -step using the CBB plugin. We will start with a fresh WordPress site running the 6.3 version and the 2023 theme, and with some sample blog content for this tutorial. To get started, make sure you have the CBB plugin installed and activated on your WordPress site. You can install it from your WordPress site by searching for Content Blocks Builder in the WordPress plugin repository. You can learn more about it on the plugin directory and the promotion site. Once you have it installed and activated, let's follow along to create your blog page. Insert a new query loop block and choose a default pattern for a quick start. Let's start setting up our query loop block. The default content width is quite small, so we will make it a bit larger from the global style panel. This plugin adds responsive grid and carousel layouts to post template, besides two default layouts, list and grid, from WordPress. We will use the responsive layout for our blog page. Let's input the column layout and gap for all devices. Now we will start setting up the content of the post template block. The next step is to add custom style to our post template block by wrapping its elements inside an advanced group block. Add a shadow. Make sure all items have the same height. Now we will add a simple hover effect to post items. We can use the custom CSS editor if we have a premium version, or we can use the free plugin block enhancements. 
Let's use the Block Enhancements plugin. Install it first from the WordPress plugin directory. Add some features to the advanced group block. Let's use this plugin to add box shadow and transform style to the post template block. Add an icon to the Read More link. Now, we will customize the blog page further by adding a new section at the top of the page to show the sticky posts. We will use the carousel layout to build this sticky section. Let's make some posts sticky first. Let's start setting up a new query loop to query only sticky posts for the carousel. Load the featured image as the background. Let's build style for post template block. Choose the carousel layout for this section.
Let's change some settings for the carousel. As you can see, with a few easy steps, without coding, we've already built a responsive blog page completely free. If you like this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up, check out other videos to learn more about CBB, and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this in the future.